Hey guys, it is Arika Misha and today we are cooking banana muffins. Um, hopefully by now you guys have seen my banana nut bread video. Uh, yeah, I'm sure you guys probably have seen it by the time you see this one. But today we are cooking banana muffins. No nuts, just banana muffins. Alright, and it's pretty much like the banana bread, just minus the nuts. But anyway, y'all. So, all right, I have in my bowl, in the bowl, let me put this back over here so y'all can see it. All right, so I have in my bowl, let me show you guys my recipe first. Let me show you guys the recipe first, because I might forget to put it down in the description box, y'all. Sometimes I'll be forgetting stuff, so anyway, y'all, don't judge me. All right, so let me show you guys the, I just wrote it, hand wrote it down on a piece of paper, my little banana muffin, little, you know, my little, Little quick little recipe. I got eight bananas, two cups of flour, one cup of butter, two eggs, one and a half cup of sugar, one tablespoon of salt, and one tablespoon of baking powder or soda, whichever one you got. All right, flipping it over for you. I'm sorry, let me flip that back over so you guys, if you guys want to take a little pause your TV or screenshot, whatever you want to do. All right, so. Flipping it over guys, in bowl one, smashing the bananas in the bowl, and then I'm going to add a cup of butter, add two eggs, add half a cup of sugar. In my second bowl, two cups of flour, one tablespoon of salt, and one tablespoon of baking soda or powder. Okay, our first bowl is what we call the wet mix. Our second bowl is what we call the dry mix. Wet mix, dry mix. So, and then after I do all that, I'm going to add my dry mix to my wet mix. And I'm going to cook it 350 degrees for an hour. Quick and easy, guys. Cooking my muffins for an hour. 350 degrees in my little muffin pan. Y'all will see my little Gotham muffin, muffin pan, but okay. All right, y'all. That's my little cute little quick little recipe. You know, you know, as you cook, you know, you realize, eh, a little too much sugar, uh, too much salt, too much this. And you just kind of, you know, change your recipe, you know, to fit what you like. So. Anyway, so we've got our bananas, eight bananas, and you guys see I'm using the mashed potato, you know, the thing that you use to make mashed potatoes, so that's what I use. It's easy. So I got to get these all smushed up, guys. Y'all will see. I'm going to smush it, smush it, and smush it until it becomes like a liquid. Just mash, mash, smash your bananas. Just mash those bananas. I love me some banana. I love bananas and I love banana bread. Uh, muffins, it's the same thing. Banana muffins is the same thing as bread. It's just a different shape. So, but today I'm cooking muffins. I cooked the banana bread the other day and the girl was like, Mom, you need to cook some more. You need to cook some more banana bread. And I was like, okay, I'll just do muffins this time. You know, just to change it up. Just to change it up. All right, y'all, let me go ahead and get these bananas all smashed up, and I'll be back. Y'all don't have to sit and watch me do it, so I will be back. I'll show y'all when I get through getting these bananas all smashed up, and we're going to add that butter. We're going to add our eggs. Y'all will see. I'll be big. Whew. Okay, guys. I just got through fighting with the bananas. Whew, child. Getting them all smashed down. Okay, and you guys can see it's like a liquid. You get them all mashed up real good, and it's like a banana. Like a banana mush, you know, like a banana pudding kind of sort of. All right, so I got my two sticks of butter, which are pretty much, uh, let me show you guys. On your butter, it should tell you, as you guys can see here, this full stick of butter right here, it tells you this equals a half a cup. Equals half a cup. Let me see. I'm trying to show y'all. Y'all know my camera be hating. Anyway. So it tells you on your butter. So this one stick of butter is half a cup. So I'm going to do two, of course, duh, to make a full cup of butter. So let's get the butter in here. Use whatever butter you want. You can use fat-free butter and all that, cholesterol-free butter, all that. Y'all know I use the, uh, I can't believe it's not butter. I love that butter. <clears throat> I will get another butter that's on sale now. Don't, don't get it twisted. If the butter is on sale, I will get it. It don't have to be, I can't believe it's not butter. It ain't that serious. So, I'm going to go ahead and get my two cups of butter all smashed in here. Get it all smashed up with my bananas. And you know what? I'm going to throw my two eggs in. My two eggs. I'm going to go ahead and throw that in. 
my bowl back over here make sure y'all can see all right come on bowl okay all right so i got my two sticks of butter in there i'm gonna go ahead and crack these two eggs in there so we can get all our wet mix together and mixed up all right so get that butter all chopped up in there y'all go ahead and get this all mashed and mixed up so I'll be back guys okay guys moving on to our dry mix two cups of flour one tablespoon of baking soda or powder whichever one you got and one tablespoon of salt one cup of flour two cups of flour right and two cups of flour one tablespoon baking powder baking soda soda powder it don't matter they both do the same thing so that's one tablespoon of baking soda and one tablespoon of le salt one tablespoon of le salt okay all right, two cups of flour, one tablespoon baking soda, one tablespoon of salt. Did I say that right? Yeah, I did. Two flour, two cups of flour, one tablespoon of baking soda, one tablespoon of salt. And you just mix these together, guys. Make sure y'all can see. Yeah, mixing it together. I just usually take my fork and just mix it all up. Let's move all this out of the way. I did. Y'all, I gotta add that to my wet mix. I got to add my what kind of foolishness? I forgot to add my one and a half cup of one and a half cups of sugar to my wet mix. It happens, child. You be in the kitchen doing all kinds of stuff. All right, so I need to add one and a half cup. Cause I was wondering like, why my sugar still sitting here? Cause you ain't added, girl. All right, child. So I gotta add one and a half cup. I'm adding one and a half cup of sugar to my wet mix over here. All right. Sure, I'll be in the kitchen doing all kinds of stuff. All right, so. We got that done. All right, mixing up my dry mix here. Mixing up my dry mix. Mixing that up and then I'm gonna add it to my wet mix. All right, got that mixed up. Let me move this baking soda and stuff out the way and salt. Move this. All right. And as you guys can see, that's my one and a half cup of sugar I added. Now I'm gonna go ahead, mix that up in there too. We got all kinds of stuff going on. I'm gonna go ahead and add my dry mix too to this. A little bit at a time. Because we're going to make some nice big chunky muffins. I don't like them little sorry little weak little muffins. I like big muffins. Let me add all this. Alright. Okay, let me get my spatula, my little mini spatula. I'm going to mix it with my spoon a little bit first. Yes. Add our wet mix to our dry mix. 
All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and get this all mixed up. And then I'm gonna go ahead and get my muffins in my muffin pan and get them in the oven. 350 degrees for an hour. I don't wanna make this a long video, guys. Don't forget, 350 for an hour. Bye. Okay, guys, I have pulled the muffins out of the oven and out of their muffin pan. And I've got them sitting on the table on a nice sort of white plate. They are cooling off. So those are banana muffins. They look so good. Let me bring them in for y'all. Look at them. Oh, they look so good. The whole house smells like bananas, like roasted bananas. Look at them. Amazing. They look so good and they smell so good. You know what? I'm going to put a little butter on mine. It's like, you know, like cut it in half, put a little butter. You can put whatever you want. You ain't got to put no butter either, but I, ju I just like cutting it open and slicing it and putting a little butter while it's warm. Mm, 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 mm. All right. Y'all seen me do it, so y'all know I did it now. Y'all saw me. All right. Banana muffins. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is Arika Misha. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, knowledge, oh, yes, it's power. Bye, guys.